podcast we got a new song from blackbeard which is my worst the song is actually easy cuz you can just hear the this thing going on the piano from the very beginning which actually just repeats throughout the whole song so no keyboard stand singing i'm going to show you two ways to play this the main riff how it actually sounds way closer to the song another one is basically more of like a strong version on the chord shifts which is also easy learn both that's great first chord is e minor open second second open 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 c major mute 3 2 open first open d major mute mute open second third second and c sharp minor mute then 4 on the a 6 6 on the d and g 5 on the b 4 on the high e string chord progression let me show you from the very beginning it's a e minor then we have a d a c sharp minor yes it gets a little bit trippy over here c major Just keep the chord progression man for now. Now let's play the E minor chord over here in a power chord way, which is the E5, having seven on the A and pinky on nine fret on the D. Keep the other string meter. Strum that once. Go back two frets down. It's five on A, seven on D. It's a D chord. Two, three, four. Now come four on the A, six on the D. It's a C sharp five. Two, three, four. And now three on A, five on D, one fret down. It's a C. You get that? That's the riff of the song. We just repeat throughout the whole song. Make sure to subscribe. Super easy, right? Now let's have a look at the string pattern. Down, down, up, up, down. Yes. Down, down, up, up, down. Now let's play down, down on the E minor chord. Up, up, down on D major. Down, down on C sharp minor. Up, up, down on C major. Now you have to practice shifting from the chord position. to just see how fast you can do and then that's great because one chord is actually hard which is the C sharp minor otherwise you can play it in this way which is also a nice way but uh it's more of like a what do i say it's more of like a stretchy version which is also hard so let's keep the C sharp minor chord over here what you can do is basically you can just keep the high E string meter like this you can just play like this That's all done. I hope this helps you out guys. Drop me one of these. Bye.